So, um, Appendix 1 in this one published paper shows an uh, open literature data set assembled by the authors from several published research papers. Um, so, these authors of this uh, recent paper, 2018, uh, assembled data from like seven or eight uh, different papers into one table. Um, you can, if you want to just copy these values, if you want to do some data analysis, um, but uh, yeah, it's um, also available in the literature. And I'll scroll down to show you all the values. And um, basically, you have oven dry density, water binder, form, volume, and strength, and then again, cement, um, oven dry density, and such. And um, these authors, uh, this is the paper. Uh, if you want to look it up on like scholar.google.com. And uh, they used, uh, I'll show you the, day, the literature they used. Mm. It was uh, this paper, preliminary views on the potential of form, formed concrete as a structural material, uh, 2005, the effect of high, uh, high fly ash content on the compressive strength of formed concrete, uh, 2001, preparation of high performance formed concrete from cement, sand, and mineral admixtures, 2007. The study of formed concrete with polypropylene fiber in high volume fly ash, 2011. Um, the use of additives to enhance properties of uh, preformed formed concrete, 2015. And finally, a method of, for assessment of the free stop resistance of preformed form, form cellular concrete, 2004. So these are the papers that they used to compile this, this data set. And um, one paper they used was this one, uh, the preparation of concrete from cement. And it shows uh, really wild um, uh, values, a range of values. Like uh, you can get uh, 30 days of strength from like 1 to 30 megapascals. It's like uh, an order of magnitude. It's like 30 times difference. And if you, um, they say the compressive strength of the foam concrete with oven dried bulk density of 1500 in appropriate mix proportion with small amount of super plasticizer reached as high as 44. So that's like 40 times, you know, the, the least of it. And these are the, the ranges they, they used as input and they used uh, some silica fume, sand, fly ash, and cement content as the ranges. Unfortunately, these authors, um, assume the additives um, as a random uh, uh, error. So they didn't really account for it. They only have a, a dry density water binder ratio form volume. And boom, it predicts strength. So I have a joke for you. Um, oh, and this is what the foam concrete can look like. It has a lot of air inside. You can see it's very porous. Oh, darling, since you've started dieting, you've become such a passionate kiss kisser. What do you mean passionate? I'm looking for food re remains. So the guy got hungry. <laughs>